So you understand what I'm saying. But parents are now too busy. Let me tell you, I'm going to say this. Parents are twerking more than their children. They're going clubbing. You are just there twerking and, and moving up and down as if your waist is on oil. And then you're twerking this side. Your child is twerking in the other side. Even I've seen parents wearing shorter things than their own children. Because you want to be modernized. You want to be seen as if you have it. Let's go back to the days where the village raises the child. Today, if you pinch somebody's child, they will tell you, do you know who I am? My lawyer will get in touch with you. They'll take it to the police. The saddest thing, and I hope I will not be proved right, but if you go on like this, I'll be proved right. In the next 10 years, please hear me and hear me carefully, because this message will be available in 10 years. We will have more rehabs than reading centers. In the next 10 years. I believe the internet never forgets. This information will be available. We will have more rehabs than reading centers. How do we avoid getting to that point? Parents go back to the drawing board. Government, be intentional. When I look at Rwanda, His Excellency President Kagame, has her, they have a culture of cleaning the city. Saturday. Saturday, right? That is a culture that has been inculcated. I have, I've had the privilege of going to Kigali. What I have seen is a clean city, yet it is younger than most African countries in as far as independence is concerned. But it's a culture. So we can do the same. Have a culture of reading. Have a culture where we say, watch this. Have a culture where we say, we are going to sit as a family. Put all the phones in the basket. Nobody to touch their phones for two hours. I'm telling you, people start having fits, fever. <laughs> I kid you not. The fathers are wondering, man, I want to know what Manu, what is the score? You know, we bought a new player. You and who? How much did you contribute? <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? <laughs> eh? So the father is itching, the children are itching. We're in trouble. Oh, we're in big trouble. And we are going into the slaughterhouse smiling. I kid you not, it is so painful. But the worst thing now, the way we are going, we will have old people very desperate and depressed because they'll have raised zombies. Mm. 